Hey guys, and happy holidays. One of the most common questions I get around this time of year is what do we make for Christmas morning breakfast? Now we have a number of recipes in the rotation, but one of our favorites is this eggnog Dutch baby pancake. It's easy to make, super festive, and it's so good. And we're gonna share the recipe with you guys today. I'm Meg and I'm passionate about finding ways to make life with kids easier in the kitchen. So let's go through our ingredients. You'll need eggnog, flour, egg, vanilla, cinnamon, nutmeg, salt, and butter. One of the things I love about this recipe is you basically just make it in the blender and the oven so there aren't a ton of dishes. So the first thing we're going to do is add our eggnog to the blender and there's some different options. There's just your regular traditional eggnog and then there's also this almond milk eggnog which a lot of companies are making these days. It's a bit lower in fat and sugar. All right, so Brooks, go ahead and pour that in. It already smells really good in here, you guys. Nice work. All right, and then we've got three eggs that I've already cracked. Let's see if Brooksy can get them in there without dumping it everywhere. <laughs> really Brooksy nice. Double. Brooksy did it. Okay, and then a splash of vanilla, not too much, or it will color it a little darker than you want it. So a little splash. Perfect. Okay, and then we have some just regular flour. Really good, all the way. And finally, we have some seasoning. All of these are optional, except for the salt, which you do want. But we have some nutmeg, which is great with the eggnog, and then also cinnamon. Smells good, right, Brooks? Okay, dump that in there. And then we're gonna blend for about five minutes. If you have a high-powered blender, you may only wanna blend for three minutes, otherwise you actually cook your batter. Now, because you're using flour in a blender, you do wanna check and see if you've got any on the sides, and if you do, just scrape that down. And now back on for about five minutes, the perfect timing for Brooks to have a little eggnog. <laughs> Preheat your oven to 425 degrees, and then stick a cast iron skillet or even a pie pan in there with a tablespoon of butter to melt. Once your butter is melted, swirl it so that it coats the bottom of the pan. And then pour your batter in and bake for 15 to 18 minutes. All right guys, well the Dutch baby is out of the oven. It smells so good in the kitchen and we sprinkled a little bit of powdered sugar on top. And now Brooks is gonna give it a try and let us know if it's good for Christmas morning. It's good. It's good, can I have a bite? Mmm, oh my gosh, it's really good. Good. All right, well Brooks has polished off his slice of eggnog Dutch baby pancake. It was really, really, really good. I'm glad you like it. I guess that means it's kid approved. We hope you guys give this recipe a try. We won't see you until next year. So from all of us at What's Up Moms, happy Good holidays. holidays. And we'll see you next year. Bye, Bye guys. guys. More please. <laughs> More please, okay.